Hi there, are you still with me? Next up um, from um, HMV, this is from the premium, the HMV premium collection line. Now, I don't know how many of these they'll be doing, how many they'll be going up to, um, but, but as you know, the premium collection, this is the UK's version of um, Warner Brothers, Warner Archive, um, and I got this in a sale. Um, so two for fifteen pounds, and I'll show you the second one that I got in the two for fifteen. But I only had this on DVD, so it's nice to have done this as an upgrade. But this is the Golden Child with Eddie Murphy, also Charles Dance. This is a um, if you've not seen it, the Golden Child it reminds me a lot like um, Beverly Hills Cop. Oh, uh, like a fantasy Beverly Hills Cop cross with. Big Trouble Little China, but this is The Golden Child, a fantasy, horror, police film, so yeah, The Golden Child. It doesn't have many features, it's got, it's, got, uh, it's got the making of The Golden Child, um, The Chosen Ones, Dagger, Design and Demons, which is like a featurette, and the theatrical trailer. There you go. Then this is a new release from Studio Canal. This is Stephen Edit Stephen King adaptation. It's a brand new restoration. This is Cat's Eye, another anthology film with um, I think it's three three uh, like films. Yep. Yeah. Again, with Drew Barrymore, she was in Firestarter. That's Cat's Eye. Then the next two are from a director called Robert Eggers. Now, Robert Eggers also did The Lighthouse. So he's, he's one for doing films which some people don't really particularly like or enjoy. But he's quite a challenging director. First up, this is a new, this is a, a new film. This was on at the cinemas. It only had like limited showings of it. Um, but this is the Northman, a Viking film. Got this on Blu-ray. Thought this was a really good film. Pretty good. Um, I know some people are saying like it's. It's probably one of the favourite ever van uh, Viking films ever made, and you know, but that's the Northman, just really brutal in, in parts. So, also reminds me a lot like of like got Game of Thrones type elements in it, with the things that happen in the film. And then this is from Second Sight. And this is a limited edition set, and again, this was another release that was delayed for like different reasons. But this is a 4K release of The Witch in this box set. I've got something on the way from Second Sight, which again was another one that was heavily delayed. And I know, like, the company Second Sight, um, they've they announced they're doing the Hitcher, which is getting a release when that comes out. Um, Martin, I think it is. Um, the 4K um, release of Texas Chainsaw Massacre. So, yeah, they're a brilliant company. But this is The Witch. This box set. I think I preferred this the second time I watched this. Thought it, thought it was better the second time. Better the second time round. I watched it. I don't know whether I was not in the mood to see it the first time. So, these are all the next lot. These are all from. Uh, majority are from eighty eight films, and the Shaw and uh, Shaw Brothers, and also um, there's a premium collection. And a few of these are Jackie Chan titles, so 
So these are all martial arts films. So first up from the premium collection line, I got this in there, 2015 with the Golden Child, but this is the extended original cut of Mr. Nice Guy, Jackie Chan. This is an era when he was doing like Rumble in the Bronx, First Strike, Mr. Nice Guy, I think Gorgeous was a 90s Jackie Chan film, I think. And 88 Films have just announced they're releasing that in the US. So yeah, Mr. Nice Guy, thought it was really good. Again, it's, it's great to rewatch uh, to rewatch this. I saw this, I think it was VHS from my local video shop. But yeah, that's Mr. Nice Guy. And then these are all 88 films titles. So we've got um, a Jackie Chan film I've not seen before, but I'd always heard about it. Dragon Lord, and I thought this was brilliant. Really thought this was just the action scenes. It was and it was it's sort of hilarious in, in certain parts. And the ending scene with the guy with the one eye, who he fights. Like I thought that was great. So that's Dragon Lord. And then we've got. Um, the rest are all got slip covers with these, so that's quite nice. So we got half a loaf of kung fu, the killer meteors with Jimmy Wang Yu as well, obviously Jackie Chan as well. Probably one of his weaker Jack. Weaker films, if my, in my opinion, I, I've seen a lot of Jackie Chan films. Then this is a film that really, really surprised me, and this is a horror, um, horror martial arts film, samurai sword film. The kit, the uh, the Human Lanterns. Thought this was thought this was brilliant. Go in watching this completely blind if I was you, because I'd never seen it before, and that's that's the thing that made this even better. So that's Human Lanterns. Guy who likes to skin women, turn them into like Human Lanterns lampshades. Then we've got um, a new title. This is Martial Arts Club. I did enjoy this film. It's not one of my favourites, but still thought it was great. And that's from Shaw Brothers. So these are all um, the next like four or Shaw Brothers titles. So Human Lanterns with Shaw Brothers. Shaw Brothers. And if you if you want to look out for Shaw Brothers, then it's the SB on the side. That's the Marshall Club. Then we've got Hero, which is more of a, like, so this is more of a modern, if you can call it, a 90s um, film. So in Corey, directed by Corey Wen. Also starring Yuen Biao. If I pronounce his name right, wrong, I do apologise. But yeah, more of a cop, like... Um, gangster cop it's action film hero and then the newest newest title from 88 films and the Shaw Brothers line this is Flying Guillotine part 2 I need to pick up Flying Guillotine part 1 that will be quite good and I thought this was great I like this film That's part three. Um, the last part, a um, majority of them are from Arrow Video. So let's do this and I'll crack on with the last part. Bye.